government slaps a 96 million dollars fine on Barama for illegal operations. Adam Harris has that story. Completed its investigation into the under declaration of forest produce harvested and into the giving of false declaration about the origin of the forest produce harvested. And as a result of the findings, the Commission has penalized Barama Company Limited to the tune of $96.4 million for the breaches. In a statement today, the Forest Commission said that it discovered breaches of procedure involving A. Maserali and Sons, Barakat Timbers Limited, and N. Sukkul and Sons. The investigation revealed that Barama was harvesting the logs from the three concessions without the requisite permission. In July, Barama transported logs from the Barakat lease and undervalued the declaration. The same month, Barama harvested and removed a large quantity of logs from the Maserali concession. At the end of the investigation, the Commission found Barama guilty of evasion of the payment of royalty and of unlawful declaration of removal of forest produce. It forwarded its findings to Agriculture Minister Robert Passat. For the unlawful harvesting of the logs from A. Masrali and Sons, the Commission has imposed a $78 million penalty. For the harvesting of logs from the concession held by N. Sokol and Sons, the penalty is $12.4 million. And for harvesting from Barakat Timbers, the penalty is $16 million. Barama officials declined to comment today. However, there was the prevailing view among them that the government may be seeking to force Barama out. The company proposes to hold a press conference by Wednesday to address this issue. Adam Harris, Prime News.